Crystal Palace similarly are a, an established Premier League team. What dangers do they pose then this weekend? They've got some fantastic players. I mean, you know, the bids rumoured to be knocking back for one of the players is, you know, astronomical, the money that people are willing to pay. So obviously, the lad there has got a lot of ability. Um, you know, they're an established Premier League team, as you say. You know, every team we're going to play against is going to be different, different tests, different strengths. Um, we're kind of coming into it a little bit blind, having not played against them. Um, but we, you know, on Sundays and last season, you sit and watch Premier League games. Um, we know a lot about the players. We know what to expect. But for us, I think, you know, we've got to make uh, Bramall Lane a fortress. Um, we did that last season. Off the top of my head, I think we only lost four times there last season. We had a incredible home record and that's going to have to be the same this year if we want to achieve what we want to achieve. How much is playing for, for Northern Ireland in the types of fixtures that you have played you know, against Germany, that's one that springs to mind I suppose, prepared you for what you experienced last weekend and are going to experience this, this uh, yeah, season? Yeah, I mean, for me personally, playing in a major tournament in the European Championships was, was incredible. Um, to play against that level of opposition in a major tournament is something special and you know I've got that experience of over 50 odd caps as well for Northern Ireland and playing in big games um, against big players and it's something that obviously I'm going to have to use all my experience I think this year uh, of playing against those players to impose myself on the games that are coming up. Just finally from me, how true is it that Sir Alex Ferguson said look one day you're going to play in the Premier League and secondly what does it mean to you that you can now go tick done it exactly that yeah um, when I was leaving he said you're not going to make it for Man United but I do believe one day whether he meant it or not <laughs> you never know but um, it, you know there was very kind words from a man of, of that stature um, yeah I mean it's ticked off now it's done put that to bed and enjoy the rest of the season